Hello everyone, my name is Zard and welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to just start a little series where I just review a random minifigure every week. So the minifigure I'm going to be reviewing this week is Darth Vader. So this is from the um, Darth Vader uh, pod promotion uh, a couple years ago. Um, I forget, it may have been if you spent $100 or something, 50 I forget. But it's a pretty cool figure. Um, pods are a cool idea, I do like them. I like when they do minifigure promotions, so this is one that I wanted to get. And the front of the pod here just says LEGO Star Wars. Then when you turn it a certain way, you can see the laser from the Death Star. So here is the figure. Um, so, the little build here just has uh, Vader's lightsaber, some like control panels and stuff. You put this down, I guess it's just like, I don't know what you would call it, it's just a little build. Um, just a normal lightsaber piece, red lightsaber. A little back area here, I believe it's the Tantafor, but I'm not sure. I think so. And here is the Vader minifigure. It's one of my favorite minifigure helmet pieces, is this helmet, because it's just so cool. How you can, it's two pieces, it's very interesting. So here is the, um, face. It's just Anakin's all beat up and burnt face. It's pretty detailed, it looks good. There's second piece, just the bottom of the helmet. Here's the front piece, or the top piece of the helmet. It's just the main part of uh, Vader's helmet. That's it there. It's pretty cool. The torso print is pretty detailed. I like that. It's just like really just a normal Vader minifigure. It's just I feel like uh, with more time it's gotten more detailed and this is probably one of the most detailed Vader figures I guess. So yeah there's the torso. Looks pretty good. Uh, there's the cape, it's the soft material, which I don't believe they make anymore. I think they switched back for 2020, I'm not sure. And there's no back printing, which is totally fine with me, because you can have a cape on there, there's really no need to have back printing. Um, the leg printing just goes in with the torso printing, so it just looks pretty good. It's not really much, but it's nice to get that. Um, yeah, so this is uh, going to be short videos, uh, there's so not really much to say about the minifigure, but yeah, that's pretty much it, um, yeah, so, I think I'll do these weekly, um, not sure what minifigures, uh, just random minifigures, just like what I'll say in the title, random minifigure, and yeah, that's it for the video, uh, bye.